Monsters. My name is Margie and I'm your Sunday spot on 7 OUAT Addict. So this week's theme is thoughts on the premiere of season 7. So pretty much anytime I talk about the whole season 7 deal, I get emotional. Even more so after this past week's episode with Emma and Killian you know, all of that. <laughs> I thought I'd just kind of talk about different little things that are less likely to trigger <laughs> my emotions. So, you know, I'm gonna try and keep this video short. Without further ado, let's just get right into the video. I think I'm just gonna kind of ramble a little bit. Let's start with Andrew J. West, who plays the new Henry, or older Henry, excuse me. And like, he is doing an amazing job. Like, I believe that's older Henry. I don't have to think about acting. Like, I believe, like, that is older Henry. He's doing such a good job. I know we're supposed to be talking about the first episode but I'm just gonna talk about everything in general oh my gosh the regal believer that's really hard to say Lana and Andrew did a really good job keeping that feeling alive I don't know it just felt really natural and real <laughs> same with Jen and him I saw this today or yesterday or something and I like I have problems I fall on, like I'm on the bed I see something um, and then I roll off the bed <laughs> And then I stay on the floor for an hour. So I saw that Jen had, um, when Andrew walked in the makeup trailer on, on uh, their first day working together, she was like, you must be my son. Ah, okay, I'm fine. And I think I'm kind of maybe probably definitely shipping Cinderella and Henry. Do they have a ship name yet? I feel like their ship name, because they their ship name should be whatever the flower was, whatever her flower thingy was with Believer, because there was Violet Believer, and now I think we need whatever forgot the flower name believer <laughs> okay officer rogers whoa <laughs> whoa like i love colin o'donohue like a lot i love colin o'donohue colin o'donohue is a wonderful actor i don't really know what else to say other than that his voice and his eyes can we talk about his eyes for a second <laughs> this is just coming Colin rant really his eyes. I don't know how to explain it. Anyway, um, you can you think his eyes are like whoa looking at a picture or like you know in the show like his eyes is like whoa but like you don't understand. When I met him like uh, uh, during like not in the photo well in the photo ops yes but like mainly in the autograph when he literally stared into my soul with his eyes and like like his eyes are so blue. <laughs> I don't know where that went. Um, anyways, also, can we talk about how he's wearing jeans? Like, I know Colin wears jeans. Like, no, I literally, you know, saw him there. Like, I was about to say a few feet in front of me, but no, I actually hugged him. Sorry. Getting off topic, talking about Colin again. I mean, like, I obviously saw him in jeans, but, like, Killian in jeans? I mean, old, I mean, Officer Rogers in jeans? I, I don't know why I'm freaking out so much. Like, his casual clothes are just freaking me out, like, a lot. Like, it's making me, like... Um, I guess we can talk about Lucy. I love Allison, like, a lot. Did you see the little birthday, her, like, it was her birthday? When they filmed the, when they filmed that episode, she, I heard the people singing happy birthday, and then I was like, wait, and then I heard Colin, like, pretty much, he, he wasn't trying to sing over everybody, but I could hear his voice over everybody, and I was like, if you don't know what I'm talking about, Allison, who plays Lucy, on her Instagram, it was her birthday when they shot that episode, and they were singing happy birthday, you could hear Colin's voice, and, like, <laughs> you could also see him in the clip, and it was like hey Colin <laughs> um what am I doing wow I'm just ranting about how much I love Colin and Donnie but uh that's not the point of this video I don't think it's really weird seeing Adelaide after seeing her in rain because she doesn't have an accent or her accent or the accent she had in rain it's just really weird Lady Tremaine is really making me hear Tiana is pretty cool Tiana is kind of like how I was with Captain Swan <laughs> like in this past episode I know we're still talking about I know we're supposed to be talking about the first episode. In this la last episode, she went. To, she was like with Henry. She was like, "Are you in love with her?" <laughs> Gosh, I really like to rant. Um, I mean, are we talking about this week's episode? Man, I could really rant a lot. Except I'd probably get emotional, which was the whole point of not going into what I'm talking about now. We're thinking about now, Marky. Stop. Anyways, <laughs> I feel like I should probably end this here, even though I haven't ranted that much. Is there anything else I can rant about? Ronnie. Oh my word. Ro okay. Oh no, I got some. Alice, like, is Alice Old Hook's daughter? Is Alice? Because, like, that look with Henry, it just, or is, I, I don't know. I don't know. I just feel like Alice is, like, related to Emma and Hook somehow. I just want her to be. I don't know. I just do, okay? I had a really good theory. More like a hopeful theory, but yeah. The way she looked at Henry thing. I mean, that could be just because she works for Weaver, Weaver, whatever his name is, Rumpel. Maybe she's not cursed. Maybe he's not cursed and maybe she's not cursed. I don't know. Is it even a curse? I'm not really sure. I can't really say anything. This is why I don't like talking about 
my thoughts on stuff. Anyways, there's a lot I could talk about, but I don't really want to talk about it. I'm kind of lazy right now. Anyways, I'm just going to end this video. I'm sorry it's short, and I'm sorry there's a glare in my glasses, probably. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you want, you can leave a like. It'll be greatly appreciated. If you guys want, you can subscribe to 7 OUAT Addicts down below for weekly slash daily once upon a time videos. All the other girls on this channel have personal channels, and their personal channels will be linked in the description box down below, as well as their Instagrams. I also have a personal channel called That Strawberry Blonde, where I do fangirly videos, such as once upon a time, Star Wars, Hunger Games, Sherlock, 21 Pilots, Stranger Things, plus more because I can never remember all of my fandom. So I guess that wraps up this video, and again, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next week. Goodbye, YouTube! Subscribe to... Um, what's, what's this channel? <laughs>